Hello viewers, welcome back. So on my left side you can see this beautiful render. And this is Arkadius Fialkowski magnetic motor. This one is very very simple, you will see. Let me show you briefly in front of my face uh, the animation. So this is how this motor looks like. And uh, you might think, what, uh, what is similar to this one? This one is similar uh, Supiach Sivas Hanumugan magnetic motor that I showed just a few days ago. And what is, what is the same? So this is really not that difficult. You will see. This motor incorporates also magnetic shielding, but in even more simple way to, because the design of stator is much more simple. Just a magnet on some housing. Let's get to the big screen and, and see how this can work. All right, so what do we have here? Yeah, transparent stator, transparent, transparent stator, transparent rotor and some magnets. And this transparent uh, material here should be out of magnetic shielding material. So basically all the magnets embedded into the rotor housing and this special uh, cut with the single magnet over here is our stator which will push the rotor magnets when the rotor is spinning. So this is just a very very basic concept of magnetic motor. So we, if we would have, for example, if we would not have here magnetic shielding, so this support with this kind of um, here stator, if it's not of magnetic shielding, it would be uh, just a steel or wood or whatever to, to hold that stator magnet that wouldn't work because for sure the opposing magnetic field would stop the rotor to spin and since rotor magnets are embedded in the shielding material as well as the stator magnets is positioned to push the rotor but also the other uh, the opposing pole this blue it's uh, very very hidden inside of the magnetic shielding this should work at least um, conceptually uh, and logically this should work I don't know what to say here more about this motor it's connected to the output generator with transmission so big wheels spins the small wheel so it's logical that this can work if magnetic shielding works but um, uh, what to say for the end? Nothing special. Let me show you in front of my face just this moment how uh, the patent looks like. So this is the patent uh, which I tried to replicate and just a few pages of it and the explanation is not that long. So if you do have time, in the description below you have the link to uh, the patent itself that you can study it and read more thoroughly. For this explanation, I will end over here. And let's go to the chair and try to conclude something. Well, what can be said in the end for this Arkadius Fialkowski magnetic motor? An amazing simplicity in approach how to fix the stator magnets not to be a round circle or a round, or a round housing which embeds some magnets, just put it on a simple column and shield it with magnetic shielding material. I would say this is the simplest design you can imagine with magnetic shielding that could probably work. If I show you now just briefly in front of my face Christopher gets an animation of magnetic motor which is also really really simple and similar and as well Supiak Sivas Hanumukan, the, uh, the animation which starts right now. You can see that both the designs are pretty similar but the only design, difference in design is design of the stator. Uh, where Fialkowski motor from Warsaw should be the simplest one I have seen so far. If you do have some comments uh, and uh, suggestions and maybe some uh, good thoughts about this motor, leave it in the comment section below. And until next video, just stay tuned on my channel. Bye bye.